Let's get it. Hey, what's going on, everybody? It's me, Kareem Ramos. I'm sitting here right now with a very good friend of mine, a dear person I've worked with in the past, known him for years, a mentor to me, brought me in when I was barely barely even surviving out there. And you guys will find out about it when you read my book, From Fat Farm to Fat Farm. This is Steve Lobel. I'm sure you heard him. If you don't know him, Google him, because I'm sure you'll see a lot of things this man has been, he's done, he's worked with a lot of artists from A to Z. As a matter of fact, A to Z Entertainment is the name of his website, so y'all can log on to A to Z.com. Steve Lobel, please, man, say something to the people. You know, I just want to shout out to the world, you know, I'm proud of my little brother right here. He's dropping this book, From Fat to Fat, you understand what I'm saying? So it's like, basically, from a fat farm, meaning overweight, to Fat Farm, which was a company established by Russell Simmons, was a clothing brand. This young man, he started, you know, he was sleeping on the park benches, and then he, he was, all he had to eat every day was Snapple, and basically the story's all in the book, uh, so I don't want to give away a lot of it, but he got with Russell Simmons and Reverend Run, dear friends of mine that I grew up with, and I came in the music industry with them, shout out to DMC and my man Jam Master J, rest in peace. Um, he started interning at Fat Farm, they gave him a chance, he was working under Maya Orjana, a very good friend of mine also, and next thing you know, he became a PR at Fat Farm, he was Rus Russell's like assistant, he was traveling around the world, private jets, hotels, doing all the marketing, placing the product of Fat Farm on all the artists, we did a lot of artists together as far as placing the product, um, and then he became a model for Fat Farm, and then after that he made a choice to leave, he came to Los Angeles. He lived with me for about a year. He's also a singer and actor. He was acting out there. He was singing. He jumped on a Bone Thugs and Harmony record for me. He went on tour with Bone Thugs and Harmony. And basically, like I said, you'll read a lot about it in his, in his book. Um, there's a chapter about me in the book. Um, he's like a young brother to me. We have a lot of similarities. His brother had passed away. My brother passed away. My mom had just passed away. He showed up at the funeral at the gravesite in the pouring rain. He's always been there for me. Um, and I respect him. I'm very happy for him. I think this book is going to do extremely well because it's telling his story. And like he said, if you don't know who I am, my name is Steve Lobel. I'm on Facebook under Steve Lobel. My company is A to Z Entertainment on Facebook. My website, A to Z Entertainment. I'm doing a book and a documentary about myself also. My history in life and the music industry is, goes way back. And um, you can Google me, like he said. And um, currently working with Man, got a big record called Buzzin'. Currently working with Ayaz, he had that big hit, Replay. We're currently working with a new artist named Sean Rocks. Currently working with Nipsey Hussle, everybody knows him. And my career has been from Run DMC and Fat Joe and Bone Thugs and Harmony. The list goes on. Like I said, Google my name, Steve Bell. I'm Corrado Mr. Kareem Ramos. And the book will be coming out soon. Please go out and support it. I'm in the book. And it's a very positive thing. So please, please support his book. And God bless him and all his endeavors and all his future projects, and he's changed his life around. If someone say you can't do it, you could do it, okay? So everybody out there, one, God bless. One thing I got to say, I'm really upset, man. I brought Steve, you know, a copy of the book so he could check it out. The publishing company didn't put our picture in there, so I'm really upset about it. So he's in here, but I'm upset that our picture's not in there. There's a picture of me, him, and Russell in Vegas, supposed to be in the book. So I got to make some, make some calls, some upsetting calls on Monday. But right, no. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm yeah. not pissed at that. I'm it's, still humble. It's all loyal, though. No, it's, it's loyalty. It's loyalty. That's the only I'm reason humble. why I do it. He got is a thank you in there, a big thank you on the Russell and everybody. There's chapters in there about me. Yeah. And you know the publishing people screw up, and the pictures not in there. You want to see pictures of us? There's plenty of pictures online. Yes. Picture doesn't mean nothing. It's about what's in here, in the heart, you know. And you're giving back, and he put me in the book. We've helped each other. It's like a little brother. We have a lot in common, like I said. A lot of work and coming just, ahead for exactly. us. Exactly. So please go out there and promote the book. And um, that's basically it. So God bless to everybody out there. Peace YouTube, Facebook, all over the place. Thank you.